It was a century ago from early July through early September of 1919 that a U.S. Army convoy of about 80 vehicles made its way from Washington, D.C. to San Francisco. This picture depicting exactly what happened, a transcontinental mission to inspect America's roads and the map showcasing the journey from Washington, D.C. to San Francisco, a journey documented in a 25-minute silent film, which we will be showing in just a moment. But first, joining us in our studios is Ambassador Michael Owen. He is the author of After Ike on the Trail of the Century-Old Journey that Changed America. Your book, explain the genesis of your research. Uh, well, I was interested in this uh, trip. I think it's really a, a very important trip in the, in the history of the U.S. And uh, I was interested in the fact that Eisenhower went along on this. He was only 28 years old at the time. And of course, he later, I think partly because of his inspiration from this trip, uh, was the driving force behind the interstate highway system. And uh, so I just wanted to see the, the actual route that they followed, which I was able to uh, follow the, their exact route. This is in uh, just west of Lexington, Nebraska. Again, these roads, obviously there had been rain, so they're pretty muddy, difficult to make their way through. Yes, and uh, you can see a, a truck sort of slipping and sliding there. They had one, um, as I said, the artillery tractor uh, known as the Militor, which was able to pull them out in, in most places, but um, sometimes it was really slow going. On this particular day, according to the log, they uh, traveled 34 miles in 10 hours. 